Welcome to the Burley Brew Podcast. I'm Kelsey Deckert, your horticultural agent here in Burley and Morton County. Today I'm going to discuss with you about mid-summer lawn care. With hot temperatures that we get in the summer, typically around that July and the June area, there are some basic care that we can do to lessen the stress on our lawns. When temperature rises, our lawns will start to yellow, as you can see in this photo. Even some people will describe it as browning up. This is a natural response from our cool season grasses we have here in North Dakota. Your lawn is going dormant and it's perfectly fine to let it take a break. But if you do want to keep it green, there are a few things we can do, again, to help it stay green and lessen the stress. Number one is going to be watering is key. We want to water once or twice a week and do that very deeply. A general rule of thumb is that our lawns require an inch of water per week. Watering it once or twice a week is better than watering it a little bit each day. That watering it deeply will promote a deep root system, which will help our lawns tolerate stress better. So if you're kind of trying to figure out how much water to put down in each watering, what we would recommend then is say, you're gonna water it twice a week. You'd put about a half inch down the first time and another half inch down the second time. A good way to gauge how much water is actually getting put down, go ahead from your sprinkler and you can put out like a flat bottom container and set it out so far out from that sprinkler head and start to see is you want to go as far as the sprinkler head will reach. So put every so often a flat bottom container, run your normal sprinkler system for however long it may run in that particular spot and see how much water is collected in those containers, adjusted as needing. The next thing we want to do is go ahead and set our mower high. So a tall turf will help shade the soil and conserve our moisture better. Shorter lawns are going to be first to yellow in the high temperatures during the summer. So again, we generally will recommend if you can do three to three and a half inches, that would be great. But say for an example, you tend to be on the shorter side of um, mowing height, go ahead this time of year and set it a little bit higher. Even a half inch will help. Lastly, we want to avoid using any types of herbicides and fertilizers this time of year. Herbicides add additional stress to the heat stress lawns. There's also a risk of it drifting to your garden, which could cause herbicide injury. Fertilizers can cause burnout, so let's wait until fall to go ahead and apply fertilizer. And even fall is going to be a great time to apply herbicides for weed control. Thank you for joining me today on the Burley Brew podcast. If you have any questions about your lawns, gardens, or trees, feel free to contact me at 221-6865. Thank you, and we look forward to having you on the next episode.